Let's dive back into the captivating story of India's Chandrayaan-3 mission. It's a tale that defies skepticism and beckons us to explore the cosmos. But what's the latest chapter in this extraordinary lunar odyssey? We will unveil a stunning revelation that's been decades in the making. Imagine this the moon, often seen as a quiet and lifeless neighbor in our night sky, has been hiding a secret. We'll uncover the mystery of moonquakes, something we thought had gone dormant. But hold on, there's a twist to this tale that will leave you questioning everything you thought you knew about our celestial companion. As we revisit this remarkable mission, let's uncover what India's lunar journey has unveiled since our last encounter. When we think of the moon, we often picture it as this serene, quiet orb hanging in our night sky. But guess what? It's got much more happening beneath the surface than we ever imagined. Let's rewind a bit. In the 1960s and 70s, NASA's Apollo missions rocked our understanding of the moon. They were the first to detect something mind-boggling the moonquakes. You heard that right. The moon was shaking, and nobody knew why. Imagine being on a seemingly peaceful lunar stroll, and suddenly, it feels like the ground shaking beneath your feet. Moonwalkers, take note. Let's fast forward to 2023, where our lunar adventure takes a thrilling twist. India's Chandrayaan-3 mission entered the scene, and boy, did it make waves. On August 23rd, Vikram, India's moon lander, made history by gently kissing the moon's south pole. But that's not the jaw-dropping part. Three days later, on August 26th, things got even more enjoyable. Vikram's trusty sidekick, the Instrument for Lunar Seismic Activity, ILSA, buzzed with excitement. It had detected seismic activity on the moon's surface, and this wasn't just any seismic activity, it was a moonquake. Hold on to your hats, because this is a piece of lunar history we've all been waiting for. Why is this such a big deal? Well, it's because moonquakes were thought to be extinct since the 70s. So, this slight tremor could unlock a treasure chest of lunar mysteries. But wait, there's more. While Vikram was busy making seismic discoveries, India's Pragyan rover wasn't twiddling its wheels either. It was out there, exploring, and guess what it found? More lunar secrets. So, here's where the plot thickens. We've got moonquakes on one hand, and on the other, we've got Pragyan uncovering lunar movements that are as mysterious as they come. But here's the twist in the tale. The Indian Space Research Organization, ISRO, dropped a bombshell. They said the moonquake appears to be a natural one. It's more complicated now. They also added that the source of this event is under investigation. So, we're left with a cliffhanger. Is it truly a moonquake, or is there some lunar magic at play? The suspense is real. Now, let's flip through the pages of history again. When those Apollo missions first picked up moonquakes, it was a game changer. They shattered our perception of the moon as a dull, lifeless rock. Instead, they hinted at a complex geological makeup hiding beneath that serene exterior. Over the years, scientists have been piecing together the moon's enigmatic interior. They've used advanced tools and computer models to sift through the treasure trove of data from Apollo and other missions. And guess what? It's like solving a celestial puzzle. In 2011, NASA dropped a bombshell of its own. They suggested that the moon's core might be a mix of fluid iron surrounding a dense, solid iron ball, much like Earth's core. In May 2023, researchers decided to add some gravity into the mix. They used gravitational field data to confirm this iron core theory. 
But here's the juicy part, they proposed that blobs of the moon's molten mantle could rise to the surface as clumps of iron, causing quakes along the way. It's like watching a lunar lava lamp in action. But we still need to finish. We've got more lunar riddles to unravel. You see, magnetic fields are the unsung heroes of planetary bodies. They're created by molten material in the cores of planets. But here's where things get interesting. The moon's interior is nothing like Earth's. It's dense, mostly frozen, with only a tiny, fluid outer core region. This is a far cry from Earth's magnetic field, which packs a real punch. So, here's the million dollar question. How do rocks from the moon's surface, some dating back a whopping 3 billion years, appear as if they were crafted in a powerful geomagnetic field similar to Earth's? It's like finding a jigsaw puzzle piece that doesn't quite fit. And that's where Shandrian 3 steps into the spotlight once more. The mission's lander and rover are patiently waiting, soaking in the lunar night. But when that glorious lunar sunrise happens on September 22nd, they'll spring to life, ready to unravel more of the moon's cosmic enigmas. And there you have it, dear viewers. Our lunar journey has been nothing short of thrilling. But remember, our lunar adventure is ongoing. Who knows what more cosmic surprises await us? Will we finally uncover the truth behind the moonquakes? Will Pergyan reveal more of the moon's secrets? And could there be even more mysteries waiting to be unraveled beneath the lunar surface? Stay tuned because this lunar adventure is far from over. So, stay curious, space enthusiasts, because the moon still has plenty of secrets up its critted sleeve. Until next time, Keep looking up at the night sky and dreaming of the mysteries beyond.